Individual orders vary by region but can be divided into two primary types, Proto-Sarkit and Neo-Sarkit. These do not appear to represent divergent beliefs so much as environmental adaptations. Practitioners of Proto-Sarkicism do not operate in the open unless the location is significantly isolated. Such sects display acute technophobia and eschew modernity, willing to go so far as to destroy or disable advanced electronics when encountered. Footnote 36. Communication devices appear to be considered especially abhorrent. Proto-Sarkic cults generally value humility and self-sacrifice. Known Orders GOI-0246 The Solomonari The ancestors of the Solomonari likely settled in the Carpathian Basin between 1200 and 600 BCE. Footnote 37 Also historically recorded as the Grimtes or Holton. It is presently hypothesized that the Sarkites assimilated the local Proto-Thracian people, eventually becoming the Dacians, a people recorded by ancient Greek and Roman sources. A Sarkic stronghold, since classified as SCP, was discovered in the southern Carpathians and is believed to have once been the heart of the Solomonari cult. Footnote 38 Corresponding with the given location of the legendary Skullamance, a school of black magic and Romanian folklore, it has been hypothesized that the Solomonari are related to, or one and the same as, the Dacian cult of Zalmoxis have been culturally melded with the ancient Proto-Thracian people. Documents discovered at SCP and SCP-2191 suggest that the Solomonari remained highly influential, albeit secretive, until the 15th century, possibly destroyed by John Hunyadi, a leading Hungarian military and political figure. Several boyars of Wallachia and Moldavia, most notably the Gutkild clan of Hungarian nobles, are now believed to have been under the control of the Solomonari, an influence that would lead to the development of neo sarkicism and its western expansion. It remains debatable whether modern practitioners should be considered true Solomonari, an event of what has been learned at SCP. Most are located in isolated pockets throughout the Carpathians, with little to no connection with one another. The religion, in its current state, is an amalgam of local folk traditions and Solomonari blood rituals. GOI-0074 Church of the Red Harvest The Church of the Red Harvest were discovered at SCP-2133 in 1936 by Gru Division P. The Foundation became aware of the sect shortly after gaining control of SCP-2133 following the dissolution of the USSR. SCP-2133 is an unnamed village located in the northern Ural Mountains, whose denizens are the only known members of the Church of the Red Harvest. The Church practices a regeneration ritual. The recent dead harvested a newborn from the turnip field found throughout SCP-2133. Members refer to the regenerative process as a part of an old covenant, one that cannot be broken, and is the last until the return of Paradise. Aditum. It is currently believed that the Church of the Red Harvest is directly controlled by a Karsist, Karsist Alka, located in a subterranean dwelling beneath the nearby mountains, connected to the village by a series of tunnels accessible via the village church. GOI-0041 The Vatula The Vatula were initially mistaken for Agori due to several superficially similar rituals. Footnote 39 Ascetic Shaiva status known to engage in post-mortem rituals. Known to the Foundation since 1969, a Sarkic connection was only established in 2010 through extensive research. The Vatula command fear and respect among the rural poor in the Indian states of Rajasthan, Himachal Pradesh, Jammu and Kashmir, Haryana, Punjab, and Gujarat. They trace their origins to Karsis Vasky whom they claim arrived from the northwest, granting them his blessing and spreading a virulent plague to their enemies.